So this unredacted, more unredacted, I should say, suit that you released today, just a, I just want to read a few of the headlines. Amazon made a billion dollars through secret price raising algorithm. Amazon execs destroyed years of evidence. Amazon doubled, doubled down on junk ads to boost profits. Jeff Bezos approved making Amazon search worse. Ouch. Um, what's most striking to you? What's most egregious to you? I mean, what's really interesting is how, uh, be it in this case or a whole bunch of other cases relating to platforms, we see like a monopoly playbook. And so in the early years, the firms are chasing growth and share, and so they'll actually compete to make their products good for people. But we've seen how in digital markets, once the market tips and these firms start enjoying monopoly power and are able to start protecting that power, we see that they start you know, becoming too big to care in a basic way, where they can kind of make their product worse, they can make it more expensive. Uh, Corey Doctorow has written about this really effectively, about the kind of life cycle that we see where at the kind of end stage of, of the monopoly cycle, these firms are just in extraction mode, uh, where they're really not having to compete or make their products better. And sometimes it can be hard to kind of imagine what the counterfactual would be, right? Like what would have happened if, if we'd had more competition? Uh, but what's so interesting that we were able to find through our investigation was that, you know, you don't have to, it, it, they weren't being subtle about it, right? These were tactics that very overtly had the effect of overcharging people by upwards of a billion dollars, uh, actively degrading their services in ways that they recognized was making the product worse. And at various points, you know, there were folks at Amazon saying, hey, like, we think these practices are actually bad for people. Uh, let's not do it. And at each juncture, they were overturned by the executive. So it's, you know, all laid out in our lawsuit. And, you know, we think we have a strong case. So in your view, Amazon is a monopoly. Yes, that's what our lawsuit alleges. Okay.